have you come across Gary Mills before at all? Uh, no, um, obviously just this season, which um, was the game I didn't play. I was struggling with an ankle uh, injury that weekend. It was a bank holiday, so I missed the Saturday and the Monday game. Um, but he's he's very much a man manager from what we can tell so far. He's um, you know he's, he's someone that he'll put his arm around players and, and tell them how good they are. And uh, I think that it's one thing at the moment that we really really need. Um, you know, in any 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 sort of walk of life, any job, you know, if somebody puts their arm around you and, and, and tells you how good you are at something, it, it makes you feel a million dollars. And that's what he's done. And, and obviously, uh, Darren Caskey as well. He's just you know, hundred mile an hour. He's bouncing round and he's got a smile on his face. And that's exactly what we need at the moment. There's no point just coming in. You know, the day after a defeat. You know, everybody's sulking, everybody gloaming. You know, I'm I'm as worse for that as anybody. I hate losing, but you know. You've just got to come in, forget about it now, right? Concentrate on the next one. Big smile on your face, and and we go again because, you know, there's people that are killed to be in a position that we are coming in every day playing football, and you know, result happens, it happens, and we've just got to move on and and focus on the next one. So on the back of that, from what you say about the the, <coughs> the positivity that Gary Mills is bringing in, can you feel a shift maybe in in the, in the feeling amongst the players at the moment? Yeah, it's it's obviously like everything's you know well not everything but there's been a lot of change you know in the last sort of couple of weeks and you know training's been a lot different and obviously lads are you know who maybe didn't get a chance you know under under the previous manager are thinking you know they're busting the gut in training to re make sure they really really stand out and obviously the lads that have been playing you know again myself included I'm I'm working even harder the you know to to make sure I impress the new manager it's, again like it's like any any job it's you know, you get a new manager, you, you need to impress him or else or else you're out the door. And, um, you know, we know that you know, obviously what the manager said in the press and, you know, he said it to us that, you know, there's going to be players moving on, there's going to be players coming in. So we need to make sure that we impress him enough to, to stay and make sure we're not, we're not the ones that are going out the door. Um, you know, we do need to strengthen. Um, we, you know, and, and the manager's sort of made it clear that he's bringing players in. Um but obviously we've just got to welcome them into our team and, and stay as positive as, as we can and keep enjoying training and keep working hard and, and the results will come.